Hey guys. Hey, what's up? Hi. <laughs> um, so it is now the new year and this is gonna be our first video of the new year. And so we thought it would be a good idea to do kind of like a progress video, kind of like the one Billie Eilish does every year. And that way we can just see how much progress we make in a year. So this is gonna be our year one. Yeah. Um, but yeah, here we go. My name is Addison Victoria Kohizer. My name is Aubrey Jean Rollins. My name is Brayden Sky Rollins. My name is Abigail Grace Rollins. Today's date is January 2nd, 2024. It's January 2nd, 2024. Today is January 2nd, 2024. This weekend, though. I am 23 years old. I'm 18, turning 19 in four days. I currently have 394 Instagram followers. Oh. Yes, yeah, sorry! I have 1,446 Instagram followers. I have 904 Instagram followers. I have 1,163. I have zero photos on my Instagram. So, none. Mine is State Dance, my junior year. My picture with the Sterniolo triplets from the Versus Tour in Des Moines. I wish. Someday, hopefully. We'll see. No, I do not. No, <laughs> but I think it would be fun. My hometown fans here. Hey, my advice to myself a year ago would be don't waste your energy on the things that are important. Stop trying so hard to like be perfect. You don't need love from other people to feel validation and that all the validation you need is from yourself. Uh, I pay my own rent and phone bill, so I live in my own apartment now. It's pretty cool. Definitely moving out of home and moving into my own little area. Apartment? Yeah. <laughs> Same thing. Getting into my own house and not living with my family anymore. Decided on where my career is going. My favorite movie is The Perks of Being a Wallflower. My current favorite movie is Anyone But You. Go see it in theaters. It is good. This is not a brand deal. Hey, but I love that movie. Okay. It was good. 10 out of 10. My favorite movie is Edward Scissorhands. My favorite movie is Good Boys. My favorite color... I'm gonna say hot pink at the moment. My favorite color is black. My favorite color is blue. My favorite color is purple. I wanna visit a lot of places. I don't really think about traveling that much because that costs money. Um, somewhere tropical, like Costa Rica, Bora Bora. I really want to visit, like, any place in Europe, honestly. I really want to visit, like, 
the New England area, like up upwards northeast. During the fall, though. The place I want to visit is Arizona. Um, either this hoodie, this hoodie that I have, or a hoodie that another hoodie that I just got when I went to Mall of America. It's like a cream color Nike hoodie, also. Lululemon leggings. My ultra mini platform Uggs that I just got for Christmas. But if that doesn't qualify, then I have some jeans that I like that I always wear. If you want to see them, go to my Instagram. Shameless plug. <laughs> my favorite clothing item is this Lulu. My favorite song is 20 something by SZA, and my favorite artist is also SZA. My favorite song is Remedy by Adele, and my favorite artist is Adele. Most of the time, I would say Lil Skies. He is one of my favorite, but right now, I'm really into Nessa Barrett just because I'm in a sad girl era right now for no reason. But, so, Nessa Barrett, Lil Skies. And then, favorite song? Driving by DWLLRS. I don't know who they are, but I like that song. My favorite song and artist is Coaster by Cat. Uh, birthday Cake by Dylan Karuki. That was Remedy. Shut Up My Mom's Calling by Hotel Ugly. The Signs by Diego Hard. No and no. <laughs> never been in a relationship, never had one. Not in one. Yeah. I'm not currently in a relationship. Um, I've been in like situationships where like it'd be so close to a relationship, but never was. But yeah. I'm not currently in a relationship. I have been in one. Don't want to talk about it. I am in a relationship and I've been in one for a year and a half. I'm gonna say my biggest regret is not getting a job sooner and not saving money sooner. It probably my biggest regret would be just caring too much what people think of me um, and like all that. Following what other people's expectations were of me and not actually following what I wanted to do with my life. But now I am, so. Skipping school. The biggest thing I learned in 2023 is do what makes you happy. Not what makes others happy, do what makes you happy. To not care what people think. Not care what people think and do what I want to do. And not let others' expectations dictate what I do with my life. That I need to stand up for myself. say like a 5.5 .5 to a 6. I would like to have a positive outlook but it's just like that's just how I feel right now. Um, things could always be better. You know? If you asked me this like two weeks ago I would have not said it. I, I would have said meh. Like yeah. But right now I think I'm in a pretty good place. I'd probably give it a 7 out of 10. Today, in this moment, I'm actually pretty good. If you asked me yesterday, I was like, I probably would have been lower, but like right now, I was very productive today, so I'd say probably like a seven out of 10. I am doing pretty good since so 2024. SZA. I love SZA. <laughs> I would 
like to meet uh, Little Skies and Nessa Barrett, but I think when we talked about it before, I was saying I really want to meet Billie Eilish. No, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's what I said. She'd be a great person. She's. I love her. Personally, I want to meet. That's complicated. Classified complicated information, man. It's even more complicated than the last was. No, I do not. I do not currently have a crush on anyone. I have a crush on Austin Robert Quirk. Keep hustling. Do me. Keep doing me. It's only up from here. <laughs> You're trying to stay positive. You have a goal for you too. I just hope we grow. I hope we don't stop. I hope we keep this going because it's, fu it's fun. And new ideas keep flowing all the time. There's new trends all the time. Yeah, I hope we keep going at this. Just figuring out what I want to do with life. Outside. Yeah. Any goals for YouTube? Just what Addison said, just like keep going, keep growing. I just want to live my life to the fullest this year and keep being happy, hopefully more happy than I was last year because it was it was a good year but also like a really sad year for me but otherwise, and keep going with YouTube. Hopefully get more people following us and we can maybe do more with our channel because that would be really cool. Get my license and cosmetology. Yeah, I've been living it to the fullest, especially like since after I graduated. Uh, when we first moved here, I was like in my shell for a little bit, but once I like got out of my shell, things have been really good. I feel like currently, yeah, if you would have asked me that a long time ago, no, but now it's, yeah. Just cause I feel like I've lived it out now, I'm just like, yeah. I think so. I think there's a lot I haven't done and a lot I would like to do, but I've done, I've done quite a bit, I feel like. The time I've been here, I'm happy with that. Oh, I think that I would be pretty happy with my life, but could shake things up. <laughs> uh, the night of my high school graduation. That was fun. If you know, you know. If you know, you know. I would say just like the few weeks, like when I first moved in here, I made so many like new friends and it was it was just so much fun yeah i would relive those moments i would relive going to europe the summer after my senior year just because i feel like i didn't appreciate it enough because there was so much going on back at home and i couldn't really enjoy it as much as i wanted to anytime that i went to mexico One, two, three, one, two, three, four. Four piercings, three tattoos. I have five tattoos uh, and four piercings. I have 16 tattoos and 10 piercings. I have four tattoos and one coming soon. And I have Piercing. Got my own place. Not my own place, but like I live with roommates, but yeah. Moved out. Live in a city. Moved town. Yeah. Moved away from home. This year, I've met a lot of people that I'm a fan of. I've met, well, I didn't meet, but I was very, very close to 
Kendall, Logan, and James on Big Time Rush, which that was crazy. Um, I met the Cerniola triplets twice, and then I met Jeff R. Curry, who is a comedian that I really love. I am going to cosmetology school. It's something that I haven't done before. <laughs> Keep focusing your energy on what matters. Don't worry about what doesn't matter. Cause it doesn't matter. Fuck them bitches that, <laughs> that prey on your downfall, you know? Keep, keep climbing, keep on climbing. I don't know what that dance was, but proceed. Just keep working hard. Do what makes you happy. I would tell myself just to keep going and everything's gonna work out how it's supposed to because even though I feel lost sometimes I know everything's gonna happen for a reason and everything's gonna work out and be fine. That your body quits before your mind does. You all slay and I love you so much. That's an Addison, Addison original baby. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Like Addison said, y'all slay. Um, thank you for watching, and I hope you learned something today. I don't know. Bye. <laughs> thank you all for watching, and if you subscribe, thank you so much. It means the world to us, and hopefully we keep growing and having fun with you guys. All right, guys. Sorry I look like complete shat, but you're so sick. So, bye! <laughs>